What's up guys? So today I'm going to be doing a product review on this cheap LiPo balancer and discharger. So you can get this off eBay. It doesn't have a brand name. Uh, it'll just, you know, you'll see it under a couple different cheap brand names. But you can get it for like 11 or 12 bucks on eBay. So it is a really cheap thing for what you get here. So looking at the unit itself, um, it is kind of a cheap plastic, but it does feel pretty solid. I mean, it doesn't rattle around when you shake it or anything. So it does seem pretty well built. On the back you got your vents here for heat dissipation because it'll get a little bit warm uh, when it's working on a battery. So something nice with this is you do have a wide range of batteries you can hook up to it. You can do a 2S all the way to a 6S LiPo. So there's all that. And then you can do a receiver battery and a JST battery like you'd find on drones. Um, as you can see, this one was cut really badly, and I can't fit my JST battery in there, so that kind of stinks. I don't know if other ones would be cut better. Uh, and then the receiver ones, the pins just kind of go right up to the top of it there. So some things, you know, aren't the best, but, you know, you're not going to expect that much from such a cheap little thing. It does have an LCD screen, which is really nice. I'll show that in a minute. So you can uh, switch between modes there, discharge and balance those buttons. So looking at what you get in the box, just the unit and the instructions, got some uh, pretty good instructions here, you know, just typical things you'd find on uh, no brand things, just bad bad grammar, not good spelling, stuff like that, uh, but they are pretty, pretty good at telling you what you need to do. So let's go ahead and test it out here. And to do that, I've got my 3S LiPo here. I did use this earlier in my Torment, so we can check the voltages here. So something nice you'll see on the little uh, battery slots there is the little holes at the bottom to line up with the little voltage checker here, just so you don't put it in backwards or something. It's really nice. Go ahead and plug it in. So you'll see it lights up the voltages for each individual cell. Shows you how many cells you got here, and then you got your total voltage at the bottom. And then some warning lights will also come on it, like if your battery is way out of whack. It'll tell you to check your battery, stuff like that. So if you hit the mode button, it'll basically just go through these settings. Uh, you could set your balance voltage limit. Just mess with it here. And you can ch set your discharge voltage. Uh, I like 3.8. It's a good storage voltage, but you know, you can change it around. So back at the home screen, uh, you can see that this cell right here is a little out of whack from the others. So just hit the balance button and it'll go to work at these other two cells and try and balance it out to get the same voltage as the middle one there. Just leave it on here for a while, let it do its thing and come back and they all should be about the same voltage. Really nice. You can cancel it at any time too. Of course mine are all too low to use the uh, discharging setting, but that'd be a great thing for like a fully charged battery that you want to get down to a safe uh, storage voltage without having to use it. Um, I don't believe you can use the uh, balance and discharge feature for the receiver batteries, but I'm honestly not too sure because I haven't been able to use either of these. Uh, but that's pretty much a rundown of the little product here. I hope you enjoyed this video. I definitely would highly recommend getting one of these things. It's definitely something you need if you have a LiPo. Make sure you have a safe, safe LiPo, you know, the cells aren't too out of whack or anything. But like I said, I definitely recommend it. I've had this thing for like three years and it still works like new. So it is a pretty good little product for how like incredibly cheap it is. So again, great product. Definitely should get one. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.